The men's and women's outdoor track and field teams head to Eugene, Oregon next week for the NCAA championships. Ryan Krauser is looking for his third consecutive outdoor shot put title, while the women's team is hoping to win the event after finishing in second place last year. You can catch all the action on the ESPN family of networks beginning Wednesday. Joining us now is Texas senior sprinter Morgan Snow. Snow will be in Eugene, Oregon next week for the D1 Outdoor Track and Field Championships. And you're going to be competing in the 100-meter hurdles and the 4 by 100 relay. In that first one, you placed seventh last year in the 100-meter hurdles. You were part of a team that placed third in the 4 by 100. What's your goal next week in Oregon? Well, next week... As a team, I plan, we plan on winning, of course, and for my individual, I just really want to do good, drop my time, PR, and also win. What would be a good time for you? My goal is to run 12.6 by the end of this year. That's crazy. <laughs> what are you averaging right now? I am, well, so far, 12.9s, but I've ran 12.8 before, so I'm hopes up and I'm moving really fast right now, so I'm really happy and really excited. As, as a sprinter, how do you shave off just small seconds out of your time when you're on the track? Well, that's definitely easy. It could be as small as your start, how, much, how powerful you are coming out of the blocks, or it could be a lean, or it could be you didn't breathe at this point of your race. It's so many small things that could shave off a lot of seconds off your time. Obviously now a lot of experience under your belt, four years here at Texas. When you look back on your career, what are you most proud of? I am most proud of my individual success plus my team's success. I think that's very important when you're in a team kind of individual. It's, it's kind of weird because we're, we run individually, but we work together as a team to all make this one goal or complete this one accomplishment. So I think that's something I'm very proud of, that we were able to successfully work together as a team, win Big 12 twice, two times in a row, indoor and outdoor. So it's just amazing to be on the same team with all these amazing athletes. Competitively, does your mind switch when you go from individual competition to team competition? Um, let's see. I... I don't know. I guess a lot of pressure might be off of you. I don't know, you know, because you can have pressure. It just depends on how you feel. You can have pressure being on a relay because you got to get the stick around and you're like, oh, my gosh, I need to get this done and we have to run a fast time and we have to qualify. But then again, you can also have a lot of pressure with just your individual race. Oh, my gosh, this is just me. I need to score points for my team. So it's, it's, I, I think it's both. <laughs> All right, let's talk about someone that obviously understands you and what you're going through at these meets is your fiance, Marquise Goodwin, who yes. now plays for the Buffalo Bills, was a dynamic sprinter here at his time at Texas. Who's faster? Um, that would be me. <laughs> so you guys do race? Yes, we do. We raced on the beach before and I beat him, but on the camera it looked like he beat me, but just for re future reference, like I won. Now, we're looking at some of these adorable pictures of you guys. We know that you guys, when did you guys get engaged, by the way? Um, March 13th. March 13th. 2014. Exciting, obviously, for you. Are you guys planning at all at this point? We, we did start planning, so we got mostly everything done. Specific date? No, we don't have that yet, but it's coming. It's all in the works. We just got so much going on right now. Me graduating and my internship, and I'm running summer, and he's doing football. It's so crazy. And he just graduated, so congratulations yes. to him as well. Now, we know with a lot of weddings these days, you've got to have a wedding hashtag. Have you come up with one yet? <laughs> no, I haven't. Oh, you know what? No, I haven't. <laughs> All right, we're going to have to solicit some responses from our Longhorn Network viewers. We'll let you know when we come up with a few, and, and maybe you use one that you heard on the show. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that sounds awesome. Morgan Snow, we wish you the best of luck in Eugene. Appreciate you stopping by the show, and best of luck to you as you graduate and leave the 40. Thank you so much.